It's the lunchtime rush hour. So okay, see, babe, how can I help you? E-cigarette users are getting their fix. Thank you. From endless flavors. Here's banana nut bread. Strawberry, peach, cinnabon. Tastes like it. Cinnamon Danish. They even have soda flavors. John Durst owns OKC Vapes. He meets customers every day who say they've quit smoking thanks to E6. It has the hand to mouth that they're looking for. I wouldn't want anybody, you know, to pick this up and start from scratch with this. It's not what it's intended for. But not all e -cig users are trying to kick the habit. It's like eating your favorite donut every second of the day. <laughs> 23-year-old Leslie Wynn picked up vaping as a hobby about six months ago. I love tinkering with things. I love building a coil. I like putting a fresh battery in my unit. She uses little to no nicotine, but likes experimenting with new flavors. It's just like inhaling flavored air, how big of a vape I can get, um, how smooth it can be. There's growing concern teenagers are curious about e-cigarettes, too. A 2013 survey of Oklahoma youth found nearly 18% of high school students and almost 7% of middle schoolers have tried an e-cigarette. And health experts fear e-cigarettes could open the door to other tobacco products. Middle school and high school students are still developing and research shows that their brains are even more susceptible to nicotine addiction. You won't find kids in OKC vapes. They don't sell to minors. They'll ask me whether or not it is a safe alternative. And could former smokers be trading in one bad habit for another? In the history of medicine, there are plenty of products thought safe uh, that uh, many years on down the line end up causing trouble. Integris cardiologist Dr. Jeffrey Sparling says it's too early to know if e-cigarettes are a healthier alternative. This is a sort of a wild west industry. Uh, there's very little regulation. Uh, consumers uh, really have no idea what they're ingesting. A choice worth the risk for these former smokers.